Good evening. I hope everyone is doing well on this Monday. So I want to go through some of these states that are reopening, um, starting with Arizona. I guess I'll go in alphabetical order. So Arizona stay-at-home order expires on April 30th. Arkansas uh, stay-at-home order ends on, well, it must have ended on April 18th. Um, he said hopes to begin to ease restrictions in the state May 4th. So uh, the, the school systems there in Arkansas will be out for the rest of the year. Same thing for Arizona. California, there is no set date for California's stay-at-home order. No set date. And the schools will stay out for the rest of the year. Colorado um, is set to expire April 26th. And schools closure, closures are set to expire on April 30th. That's in Colorado, kids going back to school. Connecticut. Did I skip a state? Connecticut. Connecticut um, expires May 20th. Um, and it doesn't miss, does not mention schools. In Delaware, it ends on May 15th. In D.C., May 15th. Um, school will remain closed until the end of the year. In Florida. The Florida beaches have already um, opened up, as y'all can see. Um, so they must have ended on April 17th. After saying he might reopen the school, he being the governor, uh, might reopen the schools before the end of the year. Um, he said April 18th that K-12 through schools will remain closed for the rest of the year. Georgia. Georgia will expire on April 30th. And the schools will remain closed throughout the year. Hawaii. Hawaii don't have a lot of cases there. I think they're way below, uh, if they even reach 500. Um, they are expect, expect to um, expire on April 30th and the schools will remain closed. Idaho, uh, April 30th and um, it says non essential business can reopen on May 1st so long as they prepare operational plans. Illinois. Illinois is going through eight. April 30th, the schools will remain closed. Indiana, the same. April 30th, schools will remain closed. Iowa. Iowa is uh, April 30th, and the schools will remain closed. And Kansas, May 3rd. Kansas will be open up on uh, May 3rd, but the schools will remain closed. Uh, what about Kentucky? Lost my little... Kentucky... Kentucky Health at Home order has no set end date. That's a cover, according to their governor. They don't know when they will, they don't have an end date. Louisiana um, is set to expire on April 30th, and um, the schools are closed for the rest of the year. In Maine, April 30th. In Maryland, um, Maryland does not have an end date for the stay at home order. Or is executive order to wear a face mask covering? Um, the schools uh, are closed until May 15th. And I just uh, put this thumbnail here showing the confirmed cases and deaths. This is the most accurate. This is like within, this is within the last hour. The numbers within the last hour. Massachusetts. Um, I know I pronounced that wrong. Until May 4th and the school will remain closed. Um and uh, Minnesota, May 4th. And if I don't say the schools will remain closed, they will remain closed. So uh, same thing with that. Um, Mississippi, April 27th. Um, he, that's when the uh, governor there is going to start allowing um, businesses to go, you know, to open back up. Missouri, May 3rd is the date for Missouri. Uh, the date for Montana is April 24th. Nebraska. Uh, Nebraska does not have a stay-at-home order. And I don't even think Nebraska have um, high numbers, to be honest. I think that they started getting numbers. I'm trying to see on this map if they're even listed. Um, I think they started kind of getting some numbers maybe today. Um, but they didn't have uh, high numbers in the first place. So they didn't have a stay-at-home order. Uh, the governor is suggesting that they still do social distancing and the school will remain closed all year. Nevada, uh, which you can see here is on this list. They have 380, uh, 3,830 that uh, tested positive. Nevada stay at home orders in April 30th. I wonder if they open back Las Vegas. Um, anyway, they don't have high numbers in the first place. Well, I mean, 3,000 3, is, is high enough with 158 deaths, but... Um, 
They're going to open April 30th. Um, New Hampshire. New Hampshire stay, a stay-at-home order ends on May 4th, and the school will remain closed. New Jersey. New Jersey stay-at-home order does not have an end date. Governor Murphy said, has said there will be blood on our hands if the order is lifted uh, too soon. Schools in the states are closed until May 15th. So the governor of the state of New Jersey said he does not want any blood on his hands. Over there with 85,301 cases testing positive with 4,362 deaths. New York State uh, stay-at-home order lasts until May 15th. Schools are closed until then. And y'all know that New York State have the highest number sitting with 248,431. 248, That's where uh, Governor Andrew Como, uh, Como um, is. And he's become quite popular. Um, he said he's starting opening the valve slowly and carefully and that upstate New York may reopen more quickly than New York City. Um, and that's because more cases or more, less cases are, are um, in upstate New York. North Carolina, the land of paradise, my state. North Carolina, um, our numbers keep growing. We all we up to nearly 7,000. Uh, North Carolina uh, stay-at-home order expires on April 29th. 29th excuse me, April 29th, our stay-at-home order will um, end. And our governor, Roy Cooper, has said he does not plan to list, lift the restrictions all at once. Schools are closed until May 15th. Uh, Ms. Cruiser will be in the house uh, through the month of May. In June, uh, we'll decide when the time comes. North Dakota does not have a stay-at-home order. And I don't even think North Dakota is on this list of states that have high numbers. Um, Ohio stay-at-home order will expire May 1st. Oklahoma, which uh, have 2,680. Uh, Oklahoma has a safer at home order, which rec rec recommends people over the age of 65 stay home. So uh, they're, that's, it's a recommendation. It's not an order. And they're lifting that on May 16th. Oregon, Oregon stay at home order does not have an end date. No end date for Oregon, smart state. Pennsylvania, uh, stay at home order expires May 8th. Let's see where Pennsylvania is on this list. Pennsylvania, 33,000. They're, they're ending theirs on May 8th. And uh, the, the governor there, Governor Wolf, said they're going to ease into it. Schools will remain closed the rest of the year. Rhode Island, Rhode Island will uh, expire May 8th. South Carolina is already letting folks back on the beaches. Um, uh, the non-essential business expires April 27th. All South Carolina public schools are closed through uh, April 30th, however. Governor McMaster is allowing some public beaches and retail stores, including department stores and bookstores, to reopen starting today, 420. Public schools are closed through April 30th. South Dakota, South Dakota does not have a stay-at-home order. Tennessee, where you at, Tennessee? Tennessee is right above North Carolina with 7,000. Tennessee stay-at-home orders ends April 30th. Um, he has, um, the governor there has asked, has, he has asked all that all public schools remain closed throughout the rest of the year. Texas. Texas ends on April 30th. And um, they're going to start opening retail stores slowly and the school will remain closed. Utah. Utah expires on May 1st. The schools remain closed there too. Vermont is through May 15th. Is Vermont on here? Vermont is a little itty bitty state. Um, nope. Vermont, uh, it ends May 15th. Now, Virginia, Virginia stay at home order as far as June 10th. Um, uh, they're going to, they're going to keep the order through June 10th. And I can't remember what, yo, 8,000 in Virginia, almost 9,300 deaths. All K through 12 schools are closed throughout the rest of the school, school year. So they're going to hold on there till June 10th. Um, Washington state through May 4th. West Virginia, um, they're not they're not saying when their stay at order will end. Uh, schools and businesses remain closed until April, at least April 30th. Um, he said later on he'll start having conversations. West, uh, Wisconsin uh, expires May 26th. So Wisconsin going to hold on just a little while longer until May 26th. Wyoming, 
Uh, Wyoming does not have a stay-at-home order. And that is all the states. I think that was all the states. So that's what's going on. Um, I didn't put all the states on this little thumbnail here. I just put the states um, that had more than 2,500. So if you notice, Hawaii is not on here. Puerto Rico is not on here. Um, trying to think of whatever other states are not listed here. And of course, we know the higher states are like Louisiana, Texas, Georgia's kind of high. Um, New York being the highest with New Jersey following right behind it. Pennsylvania and California. So that's when these states are going to reopen. And uh, but I, in spite of what your state is doing, if your state is open or never had a stay at home, just remember, you make decisions for your own life. Our state opens back up on April 30th, and they'll probably start allowing businesses to reopen. I don't know what the business or the corporation that I work for is going to do, but uh, I will be letting them know <laughs> I'm staying in the house through May. And we're going to uh, see what's going on for June. I'm make a decision what's best for me. I would like to make a decision what's best for me and mine, meaning me, my children, uh, my parents, my sisters, but... All of those people are adults and every adult have to make a decision. I can, I can strongly suggest that my family, friends and loved ones, and especially my children um, continue to stay at home order or self self quarantine at this point, self quarantine uh, until things look a little bit more clear, but, um, but everybody have to pray and, and, and be led for themselves. Anyway, before I start rambling, which I already have, this is Miss Cruiser. Please like share and subscribe. Y'all stay safe and stay blessed.